For Thorain Munt, walking the snowy streets of Penticton represents the latest stage in a long spiritual and artistic journey. Thorain was born the youngest son of a wealthy and artistic family in Burma, and his training as a portrait painter began when he was very young. I started art, I apprenticed with my grandmother and grandfather and my uncles, and I was learning mostly. I was apprenticing with my grandfather for portrait painting. When you when you specialize, you have to learn the detail of the you know skin tone and stuff like that. How to how to paint a how to paint a costume. Uh, you have to understand the texture properly if you really want to be a professional portrait painter. We are trying to translate the Persian uh, colors onto the palette as real as possible. So, yeah, there are a lot of uh, secrets uh, involved. Thorain learned those lessons well particularly when it came to painting portraits of women. I, I, was, I was a pretty good at uh, women pictures. And I was told by many colleagues and uh, many, uh, many teachers, and, uh, including my grandpa and my uncles, they said I, I was pretty good with skin tone. They told me that I can paint any any race like Croatian or uh, African or whatever, I can still use the same palette. Even as Thorain was learning the skills of becoming a portrait painter, he had another artistic passion: music. I went to Thailand and played, I went to uh, China and played, and then I came back and uh, after I high school after high school I took off again to uh, play on the cruise ship in uh, Thailand, playing some jazz. <laughs> After seven years in Penticton, Thorain finds that music is keeping him busier than portrait painting. My teacher, I teach guitar, drums, piano, bass. Yeah. As a musician, uh, Thorain I mean, is a fabulous musician. He's a very versatile musician. He, is, uh, he has uh, maybe three or four complete repertoires uh, on the guitar, on the drums. Uh, he's a songwriter, a music producer, a singer. And bass player and uh, all around good fellow. And it's not just teaching music. Thorain Yint is a very active performer. He accompanies all kinds of musicians in all kinds of styles. So he he's an observer, for sure, right? And you can see that in his art. And he's doesn't matter if he doesn't, like for example, when he's playing music, you know, doesn't, he, he doesn't even know the song, right? And he can just play it, right? Because he knows what it's supposed to feel like, right? Because he can feel it, right? So he's a great uh, intuitive, uh, reflective, and thoughtful, and... Uh, I think I'm getting better compared to years ago, I think, because I gained some experience, but, but I don't think I will, I don't think nobody will get perfect. <laughs> 